Chloe Tane. If my math is right, I'm starting day 10. A little coffee first. So I know this is not one of my normal videos. That's why it's going up on a Friday, and it's part of my series called Off Topic. Right now, over 90% of my viewership is male, and stereotypical though it may be, I think that this does not necessarily appeal to that demographic, although I could be wrong, and I'd be very happy to hear that I'm wrong. That said, let's get into it. I was getting pretty bored of my fitness routine. I'd been doing CrossFit logging into Zoom every so often, but I just wasn't really motivated. Then on my YouTube, all of these fitness results were popping up to this woman's video named Chloe Tang. And a few years ago when I was playing professional basketball in Germany, I hopped on the Jillian Michaels bandwagon real hard. So I thought, why not give Chloe Tang a try? I just finished day four of Chloe Tang's 20, no, two week, 20. That's called gym brain, friends, gym brains. Shred, two week shred challenge. It really helped motivate me. I don't know if I'm getting stronger or I'm just not working as hard because there were parts of it that were easier. I feel like my hip flexors are on fire through a lot of the ab stuff. At the end of it, when plank up downs came again, I'm like, no, I'm not doing it. I'm just holding a plank. I cannot do another round of plank up downs. So much so that I got my sister to join me. All right, the three of us just finished day three and 13. Three and 13. Yeah. Yeah, except as a very good sister, even though day 13 had three videos and day three had four, what did I do? You did my additional video. Yeah, I yeah, did I all four. It. Thank you, thank you. This is my sister Keisha, Hi. and this is her little monster. Hello, baby. Keisha is five and a half months postpartum? Yeah. Yeah, these true true. Keisha does not have diastasis, so the workout was not problematic for her from a health perspective. I am done. 14 days and you know what? I'm injured. I have a mat injury. It was hard work. I have 10 more days. <laughs> so I was on day four when you were on day one. Yeah, and she told me that we were gonna start together. But, but I got I, impatient. Yeah, she got very impatient, so I she, she had to do it again with me, so. Yes. Day what? 10! Day 10! I got the last lap there. Yeah, and funnily enough, when I was doing it, I watched a video before that said the Chloe Ting music was really annoying. I used to do Jillian Michaels videos. I know what to do when I'm sick of music. I do the program once, and then I mute it, and watch it, and listen to my own music. Thank you, Spotify, for my fave playlist ever, early 2000s pop punk throwbacks. So after maybe the second or third day, I stopped listening to the music, and I just put on my own music and followed the video, but this one, I liked it. There, liked I had like a, like three of the songs in her little um, soundtrack. That were actually really catchy, and I enjoyed it. I couldn't sing any of them right now, except the first one. That's so annoying. Uh, yeah, I'm not really a fan of. Du -du -du -du. Yeah. <laughs> highs and lows, but I think it all depend on how I was on that day. Holy! I was yeah. doing it before I broke my fast or after. Yeah, so Keisha's been doing a couple uh, dietary things to try and lose her baby weight. I'm trying to smash this smash baby it. weight. Smash, smash it. Smash, smash that like button. Yes. Smash that like button. Yeah, I, I like their little slogans and quotes. They're really <laughs> motivating. Come on, guys. We could do it. My abs are burning too, yeah. but let's smash Come on, this. we only have one more set. I know I'm really pushing you guys here, but we are almost done with the workout, guys. Keep going. So I, but I liked it. I, I, so you're doing kind of raw veganism almost. Yeah, I'm with a, some exceptions. Yeah, and then you're throwing in I'm occasional doing, intermittent fasting. Yeah, I'm doing intermittent intermittent fasting, which is the eight hours of eating and then the sixteen of the fast smoothies. Yeah, a lot. I nuts. majority of the day I do smoothies. Hummus. Yeah, I love hummus. me some good good hummus. <laughs> and then I've incorporated walking into my daily schedule just to because get this, this one, one out. Sleep. Yeah, that helps in the earlier hours of the day. And then I started drinking a gallon of water a day. So we're just trying to incorporate all the challenges. All the challenges yeah, just, to yeah. just make that quarantine we're time go by. Yeah, we're, just, we're just brewing all of a really big soup of ideas and challenges. To stuff. stay motivated. Mm. 
Yeah, but I was really happy with the results. Yeah, so here are some pictures of my results. I'm gonna get my sister to help me with some pictures for uh, results tomorrow. But it is my birthday today. And I plan on eating a lot of cake, so let's not let this uh, poorly reflect on Chloe. These are my bad dietary decisions. I personally did not take any measurements. I did not do my weight before. I did it all on how I felt and how I looked. Here are Keisha's results with her raw veganism, her intermittent, intermittent fasting, and Chloe Ting. You lost a total of eight pounds. Yeah, in two weeks, in which two is weeks. pretty incredible. That said, Keisha does have some baby weight to lose, so if you're not losing that much, like I saw some people losing two or three pounds in that time. That's also healthy weight loss. It just depends on where you are in your fitness journey. 50 seconds. <laughs> I forgot. <laughs> I wish that I got better at push-ups, but there weren't a lot of push-ups. I just suck at push-ups. <laughs> yeah, um, I really struggle with yeah, my shoulders. the plank thing. Oh. Some of her workouts for the two-week shred, she'll do like two back-to-backs of like... 30 seconds. Yeah, no and, it, and it burns. <laughs> I took a break every time. At about 20 seconds, I give up and drop one knee. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> a good way of like of like tricking myself into like just cutting through it, I would just be like, okay, just do ten consecutively. Take a break, yeah. ten more, ten more, and then when you would go beep, beep, <laughs> yeah, beep, like second yes. countdown. Yeah, she has a really good countdown. The worst was when it was like a mountain climber right into another yeah. shoulder thing. Shut up, Chloe. It's because she wants us to be strong. Yeah. Like if it was on your back, on your front, whatever, that was okay. But it was the back-to-back -back shoulder burn that got me. But even and the app one. I hate plank up-downs. That's still hard. Uh, I, I hate don't plank really, up-downs. I don't really mind them. On day 10, that's still hard, guys. You hated the hip dips. Yeah, the hip dips. Like, I, I did get better at them, though. I could say that. The bunny hop. Oh my gosh. I got, I actually, so in the second, when I was doing it the second time, quote unquote second time, when Keisha was doing it, um, I always did the ab ones with her, well, always. This tiny, tiny little uh, baby here didn't really let us, let us do our work, so I got out of my workout. Always. Did the ab ones. Um, I added some weights and did some different movements for the leg ones and for the one that you do every day I actually have a rower so I would row for that time uh, But I did notice that I was getting stronger in the second time that I was doing it But my core has always been super super weak. So that was cool. I held my first 40 second side plank ever in my life She did good. Yeah. Goals. 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 <laughs> videos were short. Yeah. Um, I feel like the only comforting thing is that she does it in small videos, so you just kind of do it chunk by chunk. <laughs> yeah, if, like it, if it was like... Designated breaks? Yeah. If it was like 50 <laughs> minutes of consecutive exercise, I like I feel like would dread more, but you're like, okay, well I have five more minutes. I'm halfway done. Okay, I got this. I right. got this when you're done. Manageable chunks. Yeah. They went by quickly. The system is really good. And I also mm -hmm. like that there's so much variety within one video. Like yeah. you're going to do the same thing maybe twice and that's only going to happen two times. Yeah. The issue for me was when there's two plank up downs in the first video, two plank up downs in the second video. She has them in most A of lot. her videos except for... The light one. Yeah. <laughs> I like her too, like as a person. I found that some of the videos, we watched a couple videos of her like answering questions or her other stuff talking about like her own life, her own fitness journey, her, she did like a 60 days like walking and no, I think I watched that one without you. Walking and she did not work out at all because her body was just like not feeling it and she just seems really real And like she talks about how some of the titles of her videos are clickbaity But that's because that's how she's getting paid per yeah. views and stuff and that you can't spot reduce fat that like it's not like okay I'm gonna go and do a thousand crunches and then I'm gonna have abs like no You might still have a layer of fat on your abs because you're eating a cheeseburger and ice cream See movie hey less hey yeah Hacking, stupid, what was happening? What was happening? I'm a savage. Just kidding, I'm allergic to dairy. Cookies. Uh, cookies. 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 Cookies.
give my I'm a sugar fiend. She is too. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Do you love food? Are you like your auntie and you love food? That face means yes. We got into a little habit, a little mantra sometimes in the middle of a workout. F you, Chloe Ting. Yeah. But I also love thanks. It. Thanks, and we love you. But also thanks, we love you. Yeah, it hurt. And Keisha, what day did you just finish? Finish 14. Finish day 14. But you can do it. Yeah. You can do it's it. It's so accessible. Yeah. yeah. It's a free program. You can't, yeah. you can't go wrong. That's really cool that like anybody can do it. Take breaks whenever you need to. Yeah. And like, it was very, it was so manageable. My sister does not have diastasis. So if you're, pre if you uh, are postpartum and you're trying this workout, make sure that you're talking to somebody and that you don't have diastasis. And if you do, that you're adjusting accordingly. And she has so many different programs as well. We haven't tried any other ones. I think I might try the, the planking one because like I said, my core is really weak and like my shoulder muscles, like these are, these are show muscles, not go muscles. They just, they just look good. They don't actually do anything. I'm going to start the 35 day summer I shred. I going to do the 28 day 20. 20. Mm -hmm. I'm going to do the, it was 35 days? Yeah, the 35 day summer shred. And it is, I don't know why you're looking at me. I don't know. Cause I forgot what I was going to say. To me, these, this is as hard as you make it. If you want to work really hard, you're going to get a good workout. And if you don't, you don't. And some of the days I didn't, like some of the days I just didn't work as hard. and. And that was fine. And the days that I did, I was we were like dripping. Oh, sweat. we're dripping. Oh. Even with the AC on. <laughs> yes, booty Stop pop. Stop looking at my bum. <laughs> AC fan in the face, drenched in sweat. Our yoga mats covered in. It was gross. Sweat we smelled real good we at did. the end of that. If you want to challenge yourself, then do it. Working out with with this little monster. Yep, yep, okay. Some days she just slept through it, which was great, and other days she didn't. So if you have a little kitty, I mean, just do the best you can, right? Some, it was lucky that there was two of us. Oh my God, stop it. And you're yeah. in quarantine. What else, <laughs> else is there better to do? You know, instead of like just eating your life away. Eat you your life just... away and do Chloe Yeah. <laughs> like, yeah. We would do so, well, there weren't any presses, but I would hold her and do the lunges or lie her down and do like the plank jacks over top of her, making faces and stuff to keep her happy. And sometimes I wasn't getting, wow, that big yawn. I'm making sure there's a zoom in right to your mouth in that video. Sometimes I wasn't. Dedicate, what, 25 to 50 minutes of your day. Some days she was good for us, some days we incorporated her into the workout, and sometimes that meant subbing certain things. Yeah, it was cool. It was worth it, and I got stronger. This is so real. This is so real. Oh yeah, swing that baby. And this is coming from somebody, like, we're on two totally opposite ends of the spectrum. You know, just had a baby, ex-professional athlete and crossfitter and we both managed to find value in this workout and I think it's gonna be whatever you make it if you want to succeed and have a hard workout you're going to and if you don't that's okay and if you're in the middle of the challenge and you don't want to push yourself move slowly go just go through the motions if you have to for a couple days if that's what it takes for you to keep moving and like just do what works for you there are some days we didn't want to do it we well Keisha always worked hard I didn't always work hard Someone once told me that, that fitter people sweat more. I am taking that to the bank. <laughs> At least you're honest. <laughs> All right, I think that's it, right? That's this it. one looks like she's ready to get moving. So I, uh, even though this is an <laughs> off topic, <laughs> come back. Whoop. All right, Winter, we're gonna say goodbye. And the way we do that on my channel, I say, may the force be with you, live long and prosper. She's not yeah, is that funny? Live long and prosper. We'll work on it. Okay, you gotta say it to you. May the force be with you. May the force be with you. Live long and prosper. <laughs> and we'll be back.